We are here inside of Illustrator, and I've drawn this square ahead of time. In just a moment, I'm going to round its corners, drag out a couple of copies, enlarge those copies, and see what happens to those rounded corners. So I'm using the main tool, the selection tool, and if I click on the shape just here, any of the dots in any of the corners, I'm going to click, drag, and release to round out the corners like so. Now holding down the Alt or the Option key, I can drag out a copy of this object. I'm now going to grab the bottom right corner, holding down the Shift key to constrain this transformation, and then releasing like so. Now I've certainly got an enlarged copy just here, but notice the corners on the enlarged copy are identical to that of the original. So the radius of these corners have not scaled as we've enlarged this object. Now, if that's what you want, that's great. But often when you're working, you will want the corners to scale as you scale an object. So let's drag out another copy of that original just there. Coming over to the properties panel, the option we're looking for is not available because we have something selected. So if I click in a blank part of the canvas with nothing selected, you'll see within the properties panel, we can now see this option just here, scale corners. So I'll activate that. And now let's scale up this second copy. And check this out. The corners look radically different on this compared to the one we worked on a moment ago. So in this case, the corner radius has grown dramatically, but the corner radius compared to the shape overall is identical to that of the original. Very nice. Oh, and a nice little bonus tip here for you guys. Notice when I was scaling these shapes up, the strokes remained the same width they were. They didn't scale with the enlarging object. If you want the stroke to scale as you enlarge an object, there's an option just down here, scale strokes and effects also within the properties panel. And one last tip that might help you out. If you're not actually seeing this scale corners option here within the properties panel, check out the transform panel. That option is also available just in here. It's currently grayed out, but if I select something on my canvas, Scale Corners springs to life as an option within the Transform panel. Okay, so I hope that helps you with your scaling of objects and corners here inside of Illustrator. Catch you later.